Hey babies, this is a review for Cherry Bundy Tart Cherry Juice. It has 200 cherries. I'm quite sure I've done a review for this before, but it's so good. I have to continue because I want you all to try this cherry juice. Now for you young people, you might not be in the cherry juice and that's fine. But for you middle aged people and, and older people that suffer from arthritis or overabundance of arthritis like I do, this helps. It's a healthy drink that helps with the arthritis. And it's, it tastes good. So, if you've had any experience with it, oh, well, let me tell you this before I, I get to it, because I know how some people are. I don't care what you take or what you use. If you have arthritis or overabundance of arthritis, it's only going to work so much. Even when you when they give you pain meds, meds to a pain management doctor. They're only trying to give you enough meds to make it manageable. They're not trying to give you the meds so you can get rid of the pain. So whether you drink juices, whether you eat spices, whatever you do, it's only going to help so much. In my case, I have an overabundance of arthritis. So that means I don't just have one arthritis. I got, let me see, I got carpal tunnel, I got fibromyalgia, I got rheumatoid arthritis, I got osteoarthritis. So I got four different arthritis in my body that cause me to go through hell and back. So I don't expect any natural products to take away complete pain. But I cook my food with turmeric. That's a natural product that helps. I drink the cherry juice, whether it's Cherry Bundy or whoever. Um, I drink cherry juice mixed with coconut water with the little chunks of coconut in it. I use olive oil and bay leaves to put on my body when certain things hurt, when certain parts of my body hurt. And I work with a heating pad. Take a heating pad and do some things. So I'll tell you about that another day. But we all know what a heating pad does. But I take that heating pad and I turn it up before I go to bed and I lay on it with my hip and let that hip that heat work into that hip. Then I also take that heat pad in the middle of the night while I'm asleep and put it on my knees. So that's just a couple ideas, but you know, I wanted to share those with you. Until next time, I'll see you later. Love you.